some of the uh, best stories about the Muppet. Uh, well, we did talk about <laughs> speaking of boobs. Yeah, speaking of boobs. <laughs> yeah. Uh, if you want to start right off the bat with that, um, well, like uh, it, every night's just a different thing. So, like, I mean, you can run into like somewhere that is like a self proclaimed devil worshiper slash Justin Timber. Like, like th- th- that's what the guy did. He like ran through the front door, busted in, and started with this hail Satan thing. And he ran on, and I was working this jazz bar at this, or like this jazz bar at this time. And it was like super sophisticated when I was having steaks. Huh. And this guy just busted in, hail Satan. And we're like, oh my God. And he runs on, on stage and actually grabs the mic from the girl and finishes the song. And the only reason he jumped in on that is because he was like, apparently like this Justin Timberlake fan. And that's what she was doing a cover of. And so he was like singing this thing. I'm like, what? And the band never stopped playing. Like they never skipped a beat. I was like, is that we're just letting this shit happen? Is, Wait, is this a, a classy karaoke steak joint? No. You're talking? What it's, what, describe the venue because so, I'm trying to put the pieces together here. Yeah, I used to work at this place called Jazz Bar in downtown Albuquerque. And the place was, yeah, it was fine steaks, fine wines, craft cocktail bar. Um, they'd have like a little small stage on the side where they bring in like soul and R&B, R&B singers and stuff like that and jazz okay. artists. And it's supposed to be pretty sophisticated, but it was downtown Albuquerque, so... <laughs> One street over, there was like a place called the library, which is like a biker bar slash just college hangout. And there's a lot of like druggies and homeless and just crazy and, stuff. And so, Satan dudes. Yeah. And, over and, there. And, and, and Satan people just <laughs> running around. So that, that's just what it was. So I was like, I don't know, just you'll see stuff like that. Or like um, actually at the same bar, there was a girl that came in and she sat at one side of the bar and she goes, and this is a really clean place. Like she shouldn't have been smelling things, but she goes, kind of, kind of smells over here. I'm like, what do you mean? I was like, she's like, I don't know. It just kind of stinks over here. I was like, oh, okay. Well maybe let me clean it off a little bit. She's like, no, it still stinks. So I was like, let me move you to this side of the bar. So I moved on this other side. She's like, it still stinks. And I was like, oh, I don't know. It's Italian. I'm sorry. Like maybe, I don't know something happened. And uh, she flips her hair and just goes, there was just like throw up on her hair. <laughs> <laughs> Some other curdled mess up there. It was like, oh, Maybe it's God. you. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, oh. So I'm like, you see stuff like that or like, I mean, I've seen like, uh, I'll go down to pick up a napkin and I look under a table and I see somebody getting like finger banged or something. Or mm. I actually had some, uh, uh, some people ordering a Patron shot from me at, at the bar, uh, a different, I was at a nightclub and I had them, uh, ordering a Patron shot for me and I see them moving like this. I'm thinking, are they dancing? <laughs> like, wait a second. He's ordering with one hand. I'm like, what's going on? And yeah, he's just, he's just like finger uh, blasting her while ordering. I thought it was amazing. I'm like, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> life is good. <laughs> wait, was like, this also in Albuquerque? Or is yeah, this Albuquerque's pretty rough. Ve- so, Vegas does their, their stuff too. I've seen some stuff out here too. Well, it's, yeah. it's funny because Vegas, people come to Vegas to go ape shit and be knuckleheads. So yeah. I'm wondering if, if Albuquerque is just as bad. Uh, it could be. Or I, is I it mean, a different flavor of, of wild? Uh, I think it's about the same. Man. <laughs> <laughs> like, j- just like crime has no cl- uh, no location, I think uh, fun has no set location. <laughs> you, everyone acts stupid when they can, you know? Get a couple of fireball shots in you. And, uh, yeah, that's what it takes. Patrons, fireball. Fireball.